Hi everyone, my name's Ian Fegan, sometimes affectionately known as Professor Shoelace, and this is because of my world's number one website, Ian's Shoelace site. Uh, now this all started back in 1982, at the age of 20, when I invented the Ian knot, the world's fastest shoelace knot, um, and I'll demonstrate it to you now. I'll use this trusty bit of rope. Okay. Now most people tie a conventional shoelace knot as follows. They do a starting knot, and they create one loop, wrap the other end around it, and pull it tight. And that can, creates a conventional shoelace bow. Now some people create two loops, like this, and simply tie a knot with them. And the result is actually the exact same knot. Now I went one step further, I create two loops, and pull them through each other. And the result is an almost instantaneous knot that again is the exact same knot. Now the knot's tied as follows. You create one loop with the loose end behind and the other one with the loose end in front. Pass the ends over each other and simply pull them through. The other information that is most critical to people is how to make sure that your shoelaces aren't coming undone. And some people tie their knot incorrectly. If you run around the front instead of around the back, it creates a loop that sits straight instead of sitting across, and that will actually come undone. If you pull it, you notice it starts to come loose, and the solution is simply to run around the back instead of around the front, and that will sit secure. So these sorts of bits of information are things that people have written to me about and asked information about. Um, I've since added how to tie, how to lace shoes, how to um, determine the lengths of shoelaces and so forth. And all this information has gone into the website for many years and it's grown to become the world's number one resource on shoelaces. And um, I then decided I'd turn it into a book. And the book is now coming out and it's called Laces. And that's going to be on, available in Australia fairly shortly.